Music Sunday is one of my favorite traditions here at Second, and uh, this year, coming back from not having, getting to really have one last year and not really being able to meet very much, this is a big accomplishment, and this is a huge celebration for us, and we're really, really excited to be able to sing again and to be able to make music together again, as um, there are, we know there are still folks around the country who have not been able to as of yet, and so we're grateful for that opportunity. Uh, so today we've got uh, a smattering of different things. We're going to open with Daniel Pinkham's Christmas Cantata. It was written around 1958. It is in Latin, but don't worry for those of you who are not fluent. Yep, it's going to be on the screen. We've got translations for you. That's right. Um, there, there, you'll recognize a couple of the other pieces that we'll do. This first one's about 10 minutes. We will um, do all three movements without a uh, break or stopping, and then we'll, we'll talk about the, later, uh, the ones that are coming later. Um, also, uh, be prepared, there is a congregation participation element coming. I will not tell you what it is, but just be ready. The scripture for today is taken from Luke chapter 2, verses 8 through 14. As we just sung, the Christ child has just been born, and uh, verse 8, Nearby shepherds were living in the fields, guarding their sheep by night. The Lord's angel stood before them. The Lord's glory shone around them, and they were terrified. The angel said, don't be afraid. Look, I bring good news to you. Wonderful, joyous news for all people. All people. Your Savior is born today in David's city. He is Christ the Lord. This is a sign for you. You will find a newborn baby wrapped snugly and lying in a manger. Suddenly, a great assembly of the heavenly forces was with the angel praising God, and they said, Glory to God in heaven and on earth, peace among those whom he favors. And you'll find bits of that text uh, laced within these, uh, this first piece. So we bring to you uh, Daniel Pinkham's Christmas Cantata. Thank you. 
And uh, King Herod was the guy in charge at the time, and he wasn't such a nice guy. He really liked power. He heard of this little, little baby who was supposed to be, you know, revolutionizing things and going to be making all these changes. And like they were like, oh no, 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 no! We've got to squash this rebellion before it starts. So um, <clears throat> I'm going to edit myself. He did some things that are not okay, and we're going to sing about them now. Herod didn't get all of them. That's as far as I can take that joke. Um, up next, uh, we've got some audience participation. I'm sure that many of you are familiar with the old tune, Silent Night, or Stille Nacht, if you're I will, at some point, I will turn around at measure 40 for all my band and orchestra people. We will sing together as the congregation. <laughs> Verses two and verse three. After verse three, I will do this. Because <laughs> otherwise, you'll be singing the kind of solo that you don't want to be singing. <laughs> Thank you. 
So the next is uh, one movement from what is typically an Easter oratorio, even though there are folks who do it incorrectly at Christmas. I mean, there, even though there are folks who do it at Christmas time. Um, so this is And the Glory of the Lord uh, from Handel's Messiah. to correct my joke because I realized that we are doing this at Christmas, there it is. And uh, obviously the glory of the Lord was revealed in whom? Yeah, a little, bit, little baby Jesus, that's right. All right, cool, so we, it, we're connecting that, right? We know that I'm not an idiot. Okay, cool, all right, sweet. Um, we've got one more for you and I guarantee you, you have heard this before. Um, if you know it, sing along if you can do it in the right tempo. Uh, so, uh, we're gonna let these bells carol and ding dong and do all those sorts of things. Thank you so much. Uh, we're, this is a great church and we have a great choir and we're so grateful for all the folks up here and for all the folks over here. So thank you very much.
shout out to Cherie, our new organist, way in the back. And of course to Micah Horton, our wonderful music director.